Hi guys, Kelly here, and today I am doing something so fabulous and unboxing something so amazing that I am just so ecstatic to share with you guys. But from the title of the video, you already know what it is, so I'm not gonna be like, oh, you won't, you can never guess what I'm unboxing. I uh, then you're like, no, bitch. We know exactly what you're what you're unboxing because we can read. So, um, I found some of the new Barbies, the new fashionistas at my local Walmart because that's where I find everything because I live there. Not really though. If Walmart wants to pay me to live in their store with products and goods, then I will. Like totally, one hundred percent. I love Walmart. Now, I don't love Walmart the way that they treat their employees. I was a Walmart employee for six months and have thought about going back, not because of the way they treat they treat their employees, mind you, but because sometimes you just need a job. So I found, I'm not sure if all of them are tall or if any of them are tall. I think at least, I know at least one of them is tall. Um, so I got the camo Barbie. I'm going to be honest, I call her Butch Barbie because she totally looks like she could be a lesbian. No shade. My sister was a lesbian. Uh, and she looks like she might be one of the tall ones, but I cannot be 100. She is not. I'm looking at her right next to a tall Barbie, and she is not. She looks like just an original. So uh, her number is 128. Can you believe that there's already that many Barbies out? I think the number goes up to like 132 or something. Uh, yeah, 132. No, 133. Though, the 132 and the 133 are the wheelchair Barbies, and they're basically the same Barbie except for one's black and one's white. And I'm like, just call it wheelchair Barbie. Call it like 132.5. So, um, I'll just, so I do like these new little sayings that they have, and if you're careful, you can get them out of the box and cut them out and put them on the wall, or stuff like that, make little cute little sayings with them. That's what I do because I'm a weirdo and I love crafting. So, um, she has, let me get my little pliers out. My dogs are looking at me like I'm crazy. They're like, why are you talking to yourself, woman? Actually, Odin is digging himself. Uh, I don't know what Loki's doing, but Sunny was staring at me like, who are you talking to? Anyways, so she... God, this... Every time I'm filming this, it says, unfortunately, Google Play... Google, unfortunately, Google Play services for instant apps has stopped, and I keep putting OK, and they keep putting it up there. Did I just pause my video? I don't think so. Okay. Did I, or did I not? Okay, so here, I did not know that I could do that. I totally just paused my video, and I totally did not know that I could do that. Anyways, they have the normal five points of articulation at the head, shoulders, and hips. Uh, they don't always bend very well. But anyways, let's check her out. She has curly hair up at the top, and I love it. And uh, if you... it has, She has a little bit of box hair, but that's okay. You just kind of floof it out there. Uh, she has on no eye makeup. She has some nice brown eyes. She is actually very beautiful. And a nice smile. She has on minimal makeup, if any at all. She has a high... They call it a high cut fade high top fade I don't know anyways uh, she just she has it's not shaved it's get it, yeah it's shaved or cut short and then but it's not fuzzy like it used to be uh, they did that one with the it was uh, she was a lighter skinned Barbie and she had like I was she was completely bald but with had um, oh my god ish it was fuzzy anyways she has on a purple camo top that says good vibes only. She has on a white watch. Jean shorts that are two separate pieces. 
jean shorts are two separate pieces the shirt and the shorts are two separate pieces the shorts velcro in the back and the shirt is just kind of loose fitting and you could probably use a, a clip of some kind to tighten it if you wanted uh, she has on what looks to be yellow hiking boots which are nice oh, couldn't do them I do believe that she is a, a normal Barbie but I will open a tall and I think that the next uh, the only other Barbie I have so the next one the only other Barbie I have no so the next one I believe is a tall but I cannot again I cannot be sure I'm not 100% positive who's tall and who's not but I think she's tall I definitely think she's a tall Barbie so let's get her out of the box so this is 122 um, I think online they call her Rainbow Stripe Barbie Rainbow Stripe or whatever they call her um, oh do 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 you ever get a song stuck in your head and you just cannot get it out no matter what you do? I watch... I am an avid American dad, family guy watcher, and there's this song. Um, this one got a little bit ripped, but you can see that you can take it and like paint it if you wanted to, or maybe you could get like some duct tape and fix it. You can do all sorts of stuff. Anyways, um, and I got this song, it's, girl, you need a shot of B12, you know you do. Anyways, and I have that stuck in my head, and I cannot get it out, and I just keep singing it over and over and over. I got Miley Cyrus's song, song stuck in my head, the, um, party in the USA for a while. And then, um, every now and again, oh, that didn't work. And then every now and again, I catch myself singing a different song. But mainly, it's just been that, that stupid B12 song. It's driving me insane. This is driving me insane. Okay, there we go. So, she has, uh, I'm going to say strawberry blonde hair. Uh, she has a normal, I would say, redhead complexion and eyes. They're brown. She has a. She's. Oh no, her eyes are a sort of hazel, actually, which is. Actually, not too many redheads actually have green eyes. It's very rare. And like only 1% of redheads actually have blue eyes and red hair. So I am one of them. Yay me. Um, but she has minimal makeup on. She has a rainbow top on and a jean skirt. They are two separate pieces and both velcro in the back and she wears some like neon red platinum not platinum platform and they're actually not platform they're just high heels and she has on white sunglasses so yes and those are nice I actually like her I was waiting for her there was two of them I was waiting for and it was uh, 122 and 123 that were the most that I the two that I wanted the, the most and then I saw the wheelchair Barbie and I freaked out I needed her needed her too they did have I think in the 80s they had a wheelchair Barbie I think her name was Becky and I thought she was pretty amazeballs um, now, I know for a fact that she is a tall Barbie, and I love the little braids in her hair. I actually tried to do that to my hair today, and it just didn't work out. Um, and I think that these are actually individually, yes, they're literally, I wonder how they got it like this, because I know that they didn't braid it like this. No way did they braid this. No, you can tell that they didn't. So, they make tassels like this, so they make, like tassels that are this color or not this color but like that are like this that already come like this and they use it for like cording for around um like couches and pillows and just to make they make tassels out of it but it works obviously great for her hair and they should do more like this because before then we would just have to like chop off all their hair 
and reroute with yarn, which would look like twisted dreads. But these are little, they're actually little braids. That's amazing. Um, I don't know why no one, they didn't think of it until now. Anyways, I'm going to stop going on. I just think it's amazing, and I'm glad to have her in my collection. And as soon as I can, she will get a made-to-move body. Uh, she will be prominently featured in my story if I ever get it done. Actually, I should probably work on it. Anyway, she has a really beautiful face. She is, she has some pretty heavy lipstick on, and, but just brown eyes. She doesn't really have any other makeup on. She has on a shirt that says, Girl Power! And then this patent leather ruffled skirt. If it didn't have the ruffle, I would totally be all for this skirt, but, and she has a gold bracelet right here, or a gold cuff, whatever you want to call it, and... I don't understand your style. These boots are, do not work with this outfit. Actually, the whole outfit really doesn't work, in my opinion, but I'm not a fashion designer. But she does have some rose-printed combat boots on. I'm not quite sure. They have floral patterns on them. I'm not quite sure. Anyways, I love her. She is awesome. I'm going to name her Red, just because of her red skirt, because that's my favorite part of her. And then I picked her up, even though this I picked this one up, even though she has Barbie's face. I picked this one up just because I don't know. I kind of liked it. Um, I just kind of wish that that because they already have a Barbie face in this collection, and it was the wheelchair Barbie. They already had a Barbie face, so I'm not quite sure why they needed to make her for, but uh, they did. And, uh, she's definitely Barbie, so, but that's okay. Um, but anyways, she's got some really bad box hair, really bad box hair. Just kind of smooth it all back. Um, I really did like the platinum blonde on top and the blue underneath, and it is just a sky blue. It's, you almost can barely tell because of the camera. But she does have a Dream All Day shirt on with this metallic looking skirt. Uh, and she has a silver bracelet on and some flat tennies. Um, and see, she, the problem is she does have, she, this is Barbie. It is, you know, a Barbie. It's Barbie's face. Which I find unfortunate because they could have done... A different molds a sculpt mold they have Barbie in every collection I realize that but um, you can only do so much you can only have so many Barbie right so but I do love her and I don't think she's a tall no she's not a tall she is um, she is not a tall either and I don't think and no she's not a tall either so now, who are the talls, though? So it's just her, then. Oh, there's looks like there's one other tall. Number 119 looks like to be a tall. That's crazy. And there's only... Then there means that there's only one... There's two petites. Two talls, two petites, three... Three original. Uh, they kind of mess with this line, because there's only three Ken dolls. Two. She's my favorite, though. So, tell me which one was your favorite out of all of these um yeah mainly I just bought her for her hair and her outfit I like the shirt but if they had given her a different skull a different mold face sculpt I probably would have liked her more um I love her too she is amazing I love the hair I always every redhead doll I I, I have to own plus I loved her outfit I liked her just because she looks so different. Like, you could honestly believe that she has the look of a woman who is a lesbian. And I love that. I love all the diversity that they come out with with these new dolls. And that's what's selling. That's what makes Barbie sell so much now is all the diversity. I mean, when in the 80s when I was growing up, this was not a thing. This never would have been a thing because... I mean, Teresa was barely a thing, and she was certainly, you know, she was Mexican or Hispanic, however you want to say it, 
And, I mean, they barely had the, the, the black Barbie. And literally, I think it was just Barbie's... I don't even think Barbie had, had one. In order to get me... I remember one Christmas. In order to get me a black Barbie, they had to find a different brand. It wasn't Mattel. And I got... So I got an MC Hammer doll as the male. And then I got some random Barbie that was black. Because my parents... You know, they try, were trying to instill in, in me that I needed to accept other colors and cultures. And I think I do that very well, actually. So, yeah, that is it for this video. I have a really exciting video coming up. It's a makeup video. Um, I'm going to leak it a little bit. It is a Jeffree Star video. So, or is it? Think about that. So, I love you guys so, so much. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in my very next video. Remember to stay strong, be beautiful, and always be you. Bye, guys!